In this video, we're going to look at how to create teacher pages within Clever. Right now, most of you are only using the school pages. You can create your own with your most used apps and web pages. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Students log in with the URL clever.com slash in slash Concord Christian. That is not the way teachers access Clever for their teacher page. You need to go straight to clever.com. So we're going to click clever.com and up here, where it says log in, you need to change that to teacher. And then if you've already entered your Google credentials at some point, Clever will pull up your page. And what you're looking at here, this part is the school part that I have set up for you to use and has all the different things that you might use in your classroom. Up here, you can use this one for things that's just for you, not for your students. But this one here that's got your first letter, last name, that's your page that you set up for your students. So we'll click on that. You can edit this to say whatever you want it to say. And then down here where it says add is where you start adding your resources. You can add categories where you can have a different categories for your different subjects, different classes. You can set that up however you want. Links would be web pages that you use in your class often. And I advise when you do that, go out and copy the link. Like if I wanted to use this one with my class, copy it instead of trying to type it out, give it a name. And then if you have categories, you will select that there and either upload a picture for it or click a icon and click add link and it will show up there for you. You can also add different apps, like some of you use Discovery Education. So we can click that and now we've added that to your class page and you can do that until you have it set up exactly the way you want. And then when your students log in, if you have created a page, yours will show up for them. Your students that you have in your classes are already synced with RenWeb. So if you click on students or if you click up here to classes, all of your classes will show up. So keep that in mind. Also something else, I don't have any classes because I'm not a teacher, but if you click this and you are in a class or you have classes, all of their names will show up here and another button shows up over here for the elementary school. It says clever badges. You can print your own students clever badges straight from that page. You don't have to get me to do them for you. If one gets messed up, uh, lost, you can print your own badges right inside your clever page under classes. So keep that in mind as well. Library would be to search for other apps. So if there are other things that you use that doesn't run through clever yet, you can request them and I can get them set up in Clever so that it works with, instead of them having to know multiple usernames and passwords, they'll just need to know their Google username and password and go through Clever. So you can choose new ones here and request them. And uh, just make sure you shoot me an email so that I know. So it's a few things that I wanted you to see about Clever that you can use for yourself. And of course, this one just takes you to the main district page, means our main school page. If you have any questions, make sure you get with me and right here's your um, email preferences and you can even send feedback. Um, if you have anything that Clever wants to let you know about, it shows up under notifications and you even have a help button and a search bar. Let me know if you have any questions about it.